And welcome back, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Quick break there. Uh, 80% of the scrubby scrub scrubbers. Not bad. Not bad. Still have tons of coal and ore here in Palomino. Pollution getting a bit out of hand, for sure. Um, you can actually place trees. I think in some tutorial or something, it does say planting trees helps, but it doesn't do enough of a significant change for it to matter too much. Anyway. Still continuing our leaderboard challenge. Took a quick check. Um, everything is updated on the hour. So I'm sure we'll see some definite change after we call this a done gaming session. I'd honestly like to do another hour worth. Another hour worth of streaming and everything. See how much distance we can get. Uh, maybe set up another area. Like just a whole other plot. Just forest it up. Um... Oh, now I'm tech level 2. Oh, this isn't the place that I'm having the tech problems on. Uh, yeah, everything is starting to mull together pretty freaking hard. To be fair. Uh, while I'm waiting, because I'd like that to be done, I'm going to get a link for the Megacycle Entertainment Discord server. If you're seeing this on YouTube, it's already in the description below. If you're on Twitch, it is right there. Welcome to join. Absolutely everyone. We walk we welcome everyone from all walks of life. And you can't really see it now that I have that back part there. But it's in the chat. We welcome absolutely everyone. It's a very open and friendly gaming community. Um, I personally run several gaming servers, everything from Minecraft to Seven Days to Die to Open Transport Tycoon Deluxe to Oh gosh. Uh, I have a Terraria server, I have three Mindustry servers, I have two Factorio servers. There's a lot running there. And we have a fairly active gaming community. So it's absolutely awesome. If you're, if you're looking for friends or you're looking to game, feel free to check us out. That's the only advertisement you'll get from me. I don't run ads. I try to keep everything as ad-free as possible. Uh, I had ads running on my YouTube channel for a while, but then I shut it off. I'm like, I, don't, I want to be supported by the community. It was really the ultimate decision I made. I don't really like having to rely on ads, if ever that came to be. So, we've got the Scrubber Crown. Actually, I could do the test here, right? Uh, we've already got 4 million monies, and I wasn't even trying. So, I researched Scrubber Mark II. What I would expect to see is Scrubber Mark II be available here. It is. Now, this one's complete. Is Scrubber Mark 6 available? It is. Okay. So when they say you're researching air scrubber technology, it should really say, as a generality, you're researching air scrubber technology. 1,155 students. Awesome. And not, you're researching Mark 2 and you get Mark 6 as a benefit, right? I don't know. Way better ways to handle that. But... Whatever. Again, the game's eight years old. I'm amazed the EA servers are even online to support this game anymore. I would actually... I would really hope that when this becomes Abandonware, if it ever does... And now there's no music. If this ever becomes Abandonware, I would love to, to host my own instance of this. I think that would be awesome. Okay. Back to the thing. Uh... Complete the... Okay, I don't care about that. Okay, I just have to wait for the air scrubber technology to just waft around, I guess. Because I believe that's a per-region basis thing. Uh, level 3 research? Or level 3 residential? Ugh. Buying 500 control net from John Megacycle. He sounds like a good guy. Am I producing 500 control net? 
I'm producing 5,250 control net. Why am I purchasing anything then? Oh, okay. After I made that observation, John Megacycle has stopped sending control net to you. Thanks, game. Thanks. I appreciate it. Are you going to tell me to build the concentrated solar array thing again? I, d I don't need that as a great work. That is the biggest waste of a great work ever. Once you have a singular mega tower up, all the conversations about power generation should go right immediately out the window. Because none of it makes any sense anymore. Can I build it now? Damn. I'm so impatient. How about now? 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 Night approaching. Thank you, Officer Cheese Doodle. Where is my... Okay, let's take a look at our police precinct, huh? We have two arrests a day. We have three people in a jail cell system of 120. We don't need more police cars or anything, just because it's nighttime. Out on patrol. Good job. Keep up the whatever work you're doing. There's a crime in progress? Oh, then it just disappeared. Oh, there he is! Go get him! Get, get him! Get, can I click on him? Oh, hold on, hold on, stop. Where'd he go? Crime in progress. Yo, I see him. Oh, are you gonna bust him? Police car. Uh... Nope. Creepy Moore. Going somewhere. Came from Century Tower. That's a weird name. Going to embezzle simoleons. Okay. Where, where are you going to do that? Oh, oh. How? There was a cop car that passed him and his first name was Creepy. Okay. Scarface Kim. You, do you change your name before you commit a crime? I mean, you probably have like an alias or something. Oh, they don't they don't call me John Megacycle. They call me uh Johnny Thrash. I only came up with that cuz I actually enjoy Johnny Cash. <laughs> you call me Skid Row McGee. That's it's a name I have. That way you won't arrest me in my house. <laughs> I don't... Yep. Uh, there's a game I used to play with uh, Aislon. Uh, Aislon, another, is, is a... I guess team member, I guess I want to say. An administrator, I guess, is a more accurate term. I'm Megacycle Entertainment, uh, Discord server, real, real helpful guy, helps out with the community. Uh, he met me years ago through a game called Corporate Machine I had on my YouTube channel. And that game is the most random thing I've ever played in my entire life. The actions that you take in that game do not necessarily, or might, hard to tell, affect what is happening in the game. It's really weird. Like, you, you're, comp you're in a business and you're competing against other companies. You research and manufacture a product to then sell to the general public. Fine. Makes sense. However, <laughs> if you reduce the price, Ideally, demand is supposed to go up. Like, that's one of the things that I would expect if you were to reduce the price and you have, like, a, a competing product, right? Demand for your product should go up because it's cheaper. You can purchase more of whatever it is, right? Whatever it is. Um, if you... <laughs> what is this Discord you speak of, Lyra says? Another another fine admin of the Megacycle Entertainment Discord server, Lyrison is... Another stand-up guy, Absolutely. Can't say enough good things about Lero. Uh, but the thing, back, back to the topic before I forget what I'm talking about, because my ADD kicks me in the face a lot more than I like to admit. Uh, that game just doesn't make any sense how some stuff works. So you have a superior product because of your research. Your manufacturing capability is high, so you can make a lot of it. And you reduce the price and increase your advertising budget. Like, you're really getting it out there. Like, this is quality stuff. And all of a sudden, your demand for your product falls through the floor. It just completely collapses. And that's not the thing that bothers me. Oh, it's a chemical fire. <laughs> hey, is that a fire? The thing that... It doesn't bother me that the game isn't playing the way I want to play it. 
The thing that bothers me is the game rarely tells you what you did wrong and why. That's the thing that bothers me. Uh, let's throw down a hazmat garage. Hazmat fire's destroying the city. Yeah. Hazmat fire now sounds like a kaiju or something. Oh, let's see. Last week it was Godzilla. Week before it was uh, Rodan. This week, uh, hazmat fires. <laughs> uh, from a game programming perspective, nothing drives me more insane than losing a game and the game not telling you why. That drives me nuts. There's plenty of them out there that do that. And it's just, it's just whatever. Maybe someone's a bit of a masochist and just wants people to feel the hurt. And it's like, you know what? I didn't win that lottery ticket I bought. I'm gonna make somebody feel pain. And then they write a game that doesn't communicate appropriately. Exactly WTF. Okay, can I air scrubber crown now? I can't. Okay. Need low wealth apartments. I actually think this is a really good cash cow, and I think I'm kind of done with this area. I don't want to spend too much time sitting on a particular area, because I think this would get... This is the new meme. This is the new meme, just music. <laughs> uh, what the hell was I even saying? Oh, I don't want to sit in an area too long. Because I think they would just get boring. Uh, let's see what this area looks like. Wide open, plenty of rail. I like it. Let's go for it. Claim overlook that I claim. Mkaw, 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 mkaw. <laughs> Sounds good. Sounds good. Okay. This is going to be another fresh start sort of a thing. What, I didn't notice. What resources do I have at my disposal? Coal, iron. Uh, I don't want to do manufacturing. I want to do another tourism hub. I think that sounds more fun. Can you get me out of whatever mode this is? <laughs> What's this? I know how to play the game. Get out of here. Did you not see me already build like five other cities? Did Were you there? Maybe not? Okay. Uh, wind is that way. Perfect. Uh, I don't think I have... Oh, I do have access to some town hall somewhere. Nope. That's not what I want. On. There we go. Why does that happen? Now it just recalibrate. Look at this. What am I supposed to do with this? Nope. 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 Yes. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. You want me to draw blocks that big, huh? Oh, okay. Oh, the story has changed. <laughs> You're killing me, Smalls. You're killing me. No, I don't want that. I'll give you a second to change your mind. Yep, this is the this is the distance I want. This 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 here. Um how do I force the game to do what I want to do? I don't know how. Draw one in the middle. Freehand. How do I freehand? Square, arched, arched, arced. Circle roads. Oh my god, what was that? Okay, draw one in the middle freehand. What the hell? Oh, it's still on circle mode. Ha <laughs> ha! So what if I did this? Okay, it does that. So let's let's draw the line a little higher, and maybe I'll get the line I want. 
Draw a residential zone. I'm working on it. So what if I do this? That's not correct, though. Okay, let's try this. Yeah, see? This is the kite I want. Uh huh. You just not use the guide. I mean, I can. Yeah, I can not use the guide. Let's see if I shut off guides. The thing is, now I don't know what the right pa I don't know what the right spacing is. The guides kind of help for whatever road you're placing. Oh, I'm really close. I'm really close. Okay. Uh, let's do this. Maybe it'll just correct itself after you build two roads. I don't want to be a nervous purvis about this, but I guess I'm going to be. Okay, how does that look? That's really stupid close. Okay, let's do one more shot. Which is usually how all my good decision making works, right? Let's just do one more shot. One more shot. It'll be fine. That's... Too... F I don't care. You know what? We're keeping it. We're going live! Boop, boop. We're doing it live. This game does have delightful music when it wants to show up. I'll oh, see now the spacing's really weird again. I I I don't care. These guides suck. I don't care. It's fine. Okay. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Nope. Okay. Uh, this road is bad. Cool. Uh, da -da -da -da, medium. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah, I want this to be a tourism joint. Excuse me. Bit of a sneeze. And I'm just gonna go wind this time. Uh, casinos and tourism are gonna eat up a lot of power, but this will be fine for now. Uh, yes, another 50,000 bond, please. Thank you. Gonna be taking this one a little more just organically, I guess. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> game, are you drunk? Actually, what I'm confident is this game starts to degrade after a while. Like, some of the math doesn't work. I played this game for six hours straight one time. And some of the resounding information I got was just weird. Because what I got out of it was, there were times I was told that the year, month I was in, was not a number. So if I come into here, it said January, year, N-A-N, which means not a number. Uh, it took three in-game years for it to just correct itself? Or three in-game months. Three in-game months to just correct itself. And then it started properly displaying... Time date crap. Worker shortage. Um, I want residential to not be on top of industry. I know I've got a couple of residential spots that are gonna flake that line a bit, but that's okay. And how much money do I have? 22k? Yep, we're just gonna go all kinds of zoning. Yeah, just keep her going. Keep her going. Petition to build a coal mine. Uh, supported. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, gambling is gonna be happening right here. I'm out of cash. Cannot intersect this road. What in the hell is it trying... It was trying to build a bridge? I'm gonna get drunk after I'm done with this stream, so any of this makes sense. I don't... I don't gu guide. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, boom, boom, boom. Boom. 
Okay, we're still on maximum overdrive level of time. Let's do that. I'm very confident I'm going to need at least one more propeller thingamadoo. Stuff that goes da 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 Uh, okay, let's get right to gambling. Uh, 15k, amazing. Guess what? Oh, now I can take out a big loan. Let's cancel one of these so I have a spare spot to take out another loan later. Uh, do people like gamble houses right next to their residential district? I don't think so. Maybe I'm old-fashioned, but I don't think so. Uh, I, I'm really not putting a ton of thought into this, very honestly. When we get some more money, I could do a little rejiggerating, but right now, low volume will do just fine. Oh, uh, you know what I should do? I should actually do something like this. Oh, I didn't mean high-density streetcar. Oh, that, that hurt. That hurt. That hurt. A big bunch. Big bunch in the wallet. Uh... Let's start with that. Nuke. I get indecisive. More frequently than I'd like to admit. Leave a little gap so I can eventually redo that road, I guess. Uh, low value. Medium value. Low value, medium value. Cool. We have our first gamble house. I'm not going to need a ton of transit infrastructure to just get this started. Petition to build sewage sanitizer approved. Wonderful. Uh, do I have enough stuff? Do I have enough water? Do I have enough power? I do. And I do. Cool. We're going to get another power turbine. Thank you. Plasma Physics Annex in Megacycle Entertainment. That's great. Yep, telling me that right now is crazy important. Uh, I'm impatient. Boop, boop. Uh, Gamble House. Boop. And boop. Cool. We have our gambling down. Done deal. Uh, how much is some transit? Just some loose transit. Uh, 20k for shuttle bus? That's fine. Um, actually. That's better. Because I know the area I'm designing here is going to change a lot less frequently than, than any other area. Uh, I probably don't need a bunch. How much are these a pop? 7,000? That's probably enough for starters. Okay. Bus stop. You hear that airplane? Like, there's a... There's a cargo plane in my left ear, and I don't understand it. Oh, park and ride. Yeah, uh... Right there seems good. And somewhere near our industry seems good. Somewhere near shops could be cool. Okay. Now, let's get more zoning. A lot of our income at the start of this game is going to be through taxation. Obviously, right? So, I'm gonna... What? Too close to an existing intersection. What? <laughs> oh. There. Because it's medium density street. Okay. It was two different kinds of street. There's the guide. There's our dude. Why? 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 What? Oh, same reason. Haha, -ha, same reason. Boop. Okay. <laughs> Can't mix road types would be a smarter statement than <laughs> whatever, whatever it says. Yeah. Too close to existing intersection or whatever. That's, that is an error. And the error is correct because it won't do that. But the reason and the explanation I'm getting is bad. That's better. How many of these did I do? Holy cow. I really am either hungry or not paying attention. Probably a, a dangerous combination of both. 
Okay. I know there's no schools. I will fix that pretty quickly here. Uh, education is important, like I said before. It's not something that is just like, snap your fingers, bam, you have education. It takes a while to ramp up. So let's do a little tweaking here. I'm still making positive on taxation, so that's good. Still have more people moving in, also good. Uh, what is our demand? Uh, low wealth, medium. Wait, what? Low wealth, residential, growing to medium density. It The game represents this like it's a big problem. <laughs> hey boss, how you doing? Yeah, it's me, Freddy Construction. Are Zones? Is his name Zones? Maybe Zones is his last name. Maybe it's his surname. I'm gonna call you Freddy Zones. <laughs> hey boss, how's it going? Freddy Zones here. Uh, you know, a lot of this low wealth residential is starting to get scaled up to some medium class. I don't know if you wanted that to happen, but that's happening. Okay, have a good day. <laughs> Freddy Zones. Because he's in the zone. Oh, this is Teddy Rhodes? Jimmy Rhodes? J Jamie Rhodes? Oh. Well, who else we got here? We got Frankie Zones. Uh, Elizabeth Power. Sure. Uh, Tommy Water. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Oh, Jimmy Sewage! Hey! Hey! He'll make sure your pipes are running clean. Jimmy Sewage. He's a good guy. Is Fred... <laughs> Fred Zanavevic. Nickname Zones. Hey, don't worry about what's on my license, okay? They call me Freddy Zones. <laughs> uh, what's this guy's name? Uh, Timmy Government. Sure. Uh, Ezekiel Waste Disposal. I don't know. Oh, uh, oh shit! There's a fire. Oh, there's a lot of fire. <laughs> this little game has come to an abrupt end because my shit's all on fire. Uh, let's go there, sure. And you probably need another moose to spruce the caboose. Uh, I don't have enough money. Oh, uh... <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be a problem. Uh, is there anyone else? Uh... Timmy Police... Rather Ratherford Education. That's not his name. He's just screaming about the 17 fires raging in your city. Fire! Oh, hey, nice to meet you, Fire. My name is John. No! Fire! Uh, Elizabeth Buses? I don't know. Samantha Streetcars? I don't know. She, she manages all this? Holy crap, she is a busy woman. Parks? Oh, I don't know. Bethany Parks? I don't know. Oh, there's no one representing... Do I have a UFO encounter, Earthquake, Meteor Strike, Outworlder 6, Big Lizard, Zombie Attack. Okay. I've had the Zombie Attack thrown at me like four times. Nothing happens. Not too sure what the deal with it is. I don't know how important the Zombie Attack is. Even the big lizard, like, all that happens is he just stomps his way over to your trash, screws up your garbage, and that's it. Making profits. Making profits. I'm liking it. Okay. What can we do about tourism? Like, straight-up tourism. Dutch Windmill. Brandenburg Gate. I think we already built one of those. Or maybe I haven't. Uh, Eiffel 65. Not gonna try. We already have a big ba- Oh! I'm in a different region! <laughs> Damn it, the council still hasn't approved aliens. <laughs> uh... The Oslo Opera House. Yeah, right next to my gambling-addicted sims. That seems good. Everything seems good. Oop, I accidentally blew up an actually decent house. Oops. Yeah. 
If our tech level is higher here than my other city that I'm actively trying to tech... Okay. I was gonna say, I will flip tables. <laughs> Casino sign helps attract tourists. Oh. I thought it was just a novelty for us human types. I didn't know it was actually a thing. Uh, okay. Let's, let's keep this kind of smart. Sure. Oh, should it be on the highway? Can I chuck it on... Oh. That would make the most sense, right? Put that there. If it just, if it just exists. Sure. The advertisement for this casino is on this side of the road. Cool. Yep. Cracker Jack City Planning. That's what I say. That goes away. Watch, this won't connect now. Okay, cool. I'm amazed. I'm amazed anything works at all. Can I parking garage this? No. Okay. Uh, we have medical problems. We have education problems. Classrooms full. You can't build any higher. We don't need a PE class. We just have to make sure the students use stairs up and down all the time. Yep. Yep. Thank you, Ratherford Education. Or whatever I named you before, I forgot. Richter Education. He probably has, like, five middle names or something. Education. What is happening here? There's a lot of people just standing around. There's a lot of red shirt people. What the heck? Yeah, there's a lot of specifically red shirted people. Isn't that the isn't that the joke of Star Trek or whatever? If you're wearing a red shirt, you're just a casualty. Like it's a character that doesn't even have like a last name. What's your name? James. Oh yeah? What do you do? Uh engineering. You're new, I haven't seen your face before. Oh, I just got hired by uh, Fleet Command. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh willing to serve. Yep, absolutely. Here for the Federation and all that. And then by the end of the episode he just gets killed. Or dies or whatever. Oh no! I forgot his name! It doesn't matter, he wasn't the lead character anyway! Shoot! <laughs> it's just like, yeah. Well, that's a red shirt. <laughs> I'm pretty confident that's that's the meme. I'm pretty confident that's the joke. Okay, more... I did this wrong, didn't I? I sure did. And there is still that plane that is dropping bombs in my ear set. Ear set? Headset. Something something set. I don't know. Uh, I tried to buy, uh, look for a headset for a friend. I was gonna buy it for him as a gift, and I did a, I did like an Amazon search, and I'm like, headset. And I didn't find what I wanted, like, right away, because I think it thought I meant, like, earmuffs or something, and I'm like, what are those called? It's not a headphone. Or an earphone? Earplugs? Like, I'm like, there's so many ways to call out that item, and I can't figure out for life of me how to call out that item. It's just such a weird... I'm like, oh, head... Is it a headset? Are they headphones? Are they head jacks? What... What, what are... What even are things? Okay, a couple of parks just get us to some medium, medium residential. Which, yeah, crazy demand for medium residential. In ears and over ears is a specific term. You know what? Perfect. I love it. There was a there was a conversation, I don't know if I heard it or I read it in a paper or whatever, but changing a, a complete language nomenclature instead of saying anything as a negative, you say it as the opposite of a positive. So the whole nomenclature, instead of saying I'm getting stronger or I'm getting weaker. It's confusing to someone that doesn't speak English natively because in both statements, they are gaining something. Gaining is something that's usually derived as a positive thing. I'm gaining strength. I'm gain I'm getting stronger. But I've also heard I'm getting weaker, which can be confusing as well. So there was a, I, I don't remember for life of me where I heard it from. But one of the things that was really interesting about it, it was saying, instead of ever claiming something in the I'm positive, or in, instead of ever saying, like, I'm getting weaker, which still sounds like the positive, you would stay, say it always in the, po in the negative as I'm losing strength. 
Though you'd always regard the same attribute and not use a completely different adjective to describe what it is. And I'm probably explaining this wrong, probably awfully. But it was just an interesting thing because now that I'm we're having this conversation here, it's like, how do you what do you call a headset? What is it? Is it headphones? Earheads? Face head? Cheese doodle? I don't. <sighs> so you're not you're gaining strength or you're losing strength. You're not getting weaker. You don't gain weakness. I mean, you can, but it just sounds really weird. Yeah, I don't remember who I had that conversation with, and I'm probably misrepresenting it because I'm trying to keep a keep an eye on Captain Police over here. Crime waves all over the city. Huh. I wonder, you know what? So I should should I be giving you all these voices? Maybe maybe Captain Police here has a different motive, and his objective truly is to promote crime. Yes, <laughs> Captain Police here on the scene. Uh, just to let you know, Mayor, there's a crime wave. <laughs> yes, quite. <laughs> it's a wonderful night for crime. What time is it? Oh, soon to be nightfall, yes. Quite amount of crime we're having, yes, quite. <laughs> oh, yes, no, the ne'er-do-wellers will be out for quite an evening, yes, quite. <laughs> oh, no, that's terrible, Mayor, yes, for sure, yes. Oh, no, no, I'm very anti-crime, as you know. <laughs> crime. And that's what he does. Maybe after he says something, it just chuckles and just says, <laughs> crime. That would be dumb. But that kind of fits my profile. All right, second you come in, trash. That's the case in English because it's a mix of several language groups. Oh, I absolutely get it. It's just if it's one of those conversations, like if you ever had a chance to redo it, get everything to some sort of a normative. You don't have such audacious confusion. So that's that's what Captain Captain Police does. After he says anything, he snickers and in a very odd accent. It's a crime. Uh, yo, uh, Captain. Gonna be going getting donuts. Uh, maybe pick up some lunch for the rest of the force. Uh, what did you want again? Aha, uh -huh. jelly donuts. <laughs> crime. <laughs> it's just like, uh, I don't think crime is a flavor. I don't think they're good. They're, they're not gonna have crime donuts. Is crime donuts a thing? Are they gonna have crime? Uh, I'll check. You know, you know, for you, Captain, I'll check. I'll check to see if they have. Your brand of donut. Oh, extra sprinkles, extra sprinkles, please. <laughs> Crime. <laughs> Just like, all right. I think we need a new police chief. This one's off his rocker. A little bit of fire. A little bit of fire. Fire's good, right? Uh, crime wave. Yeah, I heard you. Injured Sims, right? We need to do something about that. I'm not building a hospital. You're off your. You're off your gourd. Let's go ahead and just get the basic facilities online and uh, see where we're at. See if we can pay off some bonds, because I know I've got a few running. Going to be aiming really heavy to tourism on this one. Not enough simoleons. Okay, well, I guess I'm not paying off crap. The other solution is to go the way of Slavic languages, where there's no getting in that sentence. The word stronger or weaker changes to reflect what's actively happening. The dynamics of grammar are a lot more difficult for foreigners. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of figured that. It's kind of the same way from a language perspective how... What was it, Roman? Roman language, like, had a gender for each item? Like, a spoon was a, was female. Like, that's not con that's not confusing. Like, no one's gonna get confused when you're trying to communicate that information. Um, I need another fire truck. That's German? Okay. <laughs> Just like... If you had... A bowl with a spoon next to a fork. That's a bad example because I don't know the answer, but that might actually cross two genders or three genders or or, or however you preposition that information. It just sounds incredibly confusing. Okay. What have we got going on? We got a fairly decently sized city. Uh, our specialization is bringing in quite a bit of coin. We're not making a lot of money, though. Like, overall. So how is our tourism doing? You're 38000 a day in profit. You are 20000 a day in profit. That's not bad. Small potatoes. But that's not bad. Uh, what I need to do... City burning. It isn't anymore. Ten buildings burned down per day. You're making that sound like it's a good statistic. 
But I do need another fire truck. Can I build two? Nope, just one. Fire coverage for neighbors available. Are you high? My crap's on fire. No, it's not. It's not available. Stop that. This is kind of an easy spot where people can get caught up in the game because when you're starting to make any amount of real coin, when you're in like the 5,000 range, that's really where the other systems come in and start taking from you. So what I mean, what do I mean by that? Well, right when the game starts, you don't really have to worry about anything because there's too few people to worry about anything. As the game quickly progresses, though, you need education, fire, police protection. You need all these services, right? To make sure your city doesn't, oh, I don't know, burn to the ground. Um, and that's where you can get, like, a really nice jump. If you play it right, you can have plus 7, 8, 9, 10, 11,000. A good amount of cashish. And then you start building these ancillary systems that you require. And now it's like, well, I don't have any money to continue the game. What's the deal? That's where you got to be super careful. So right now, I've got a couple of bonds out. I'm just going to upgrade a few of these to medium because I have the zoning. Oop, I don't want high. It's Trips Bro. Welcome, dude. This is rad. <laughs> now you're speaking my language, the speak of the 1980s. Cowabunga, dude. Tubular. There could be as much as seven variations of every word to specify time and continuity, so German is by far not the worst. Oh, I'm not saying it was. I'm just saying, I don't want to learn German anytime soon. I barely have English locked in. Oh, snap, what just happened? It's Trips Bro, subscribe with Prime! Oh, I forgot I had Mega Man up there. <laughs> oh, look at him go. So excited. Oh, I realize there's a delay. Now that I'm probably saying, Oh, it's Mega Man up there. Now he's probably well gone like 10 seconds ago. Ah, the timing. The timing. Alright, welcome to the stream, stream trips. Nah. It was on time. Oh, sweet. Radical. Okay. Uh, any... <laughs> I like to think that any logical mayor... We start paying off some debt. So, oop, four thousand four hundred an hour. That's not too bad. We'll take this a little slowish, and we'll see where we're at. One or two second delay. I'm down. I'm down. The latest rage townhouses. Murder on the loose. To the tune of burning down the house. I don't remember what song that's from, but it's like burning down the house. So now it's just murder on the loose. Who pays off debt? This guy. Hey, they call me Johnny Fiscally Responsible Megacycle. You want to have a chat with me? You talk to my accountant. Why my accountant? Because he'll also tell you I'm freaking fiscally responsible. Congestion's not too bad. I'd like to zone way more. Uh, I don't know if we've got the stuff for that, though. I need plenty of room for wind power. Wow, that actually lined up. Holy crap. And I used the wrong road. Again. Uh, demote to low density. There are chunks of the map I don't want to evolve up. The economic chain because I need low qual or low wealth workers to do stuff. Just applied for TSFA. What in the hell is that? Like a bean burrito but with cheese? Like what? What is that? You kids and your acronyms. I can't keep up. Oh yeah, I just applied for an LMNOP. Might be a candidate thing, but it's a tax-free savings account. Uh, there's, there's a similar one for Americans, uh, but it's only for, like, medical. It's a medical account kind of a thing. But no, it's good for you, dude. 
Okay, shuttle bus. How we doing? How long does it take for somebody to get a ride? Probably a lot longer now that I added way more crap. Uh, yep. 21 minutes. That's not too shabby. Let's add a little bit more, though. Now, basically, you put money into it gains interest tax-free. That's incredible. That is not an American thing. I will guarantee that is not an American thing. It sounds amazing. Good audience so far, but I don't want kids playing hooky. Will you please pay some extra attention? Make sure children get the class. What do you want me to do about that? Have 60 students get to public schools in one day. Aren't you teaching like 600 students? It's never really free. Every 5G, I think it's 1.6G in five years. I'm gonna let you two fight that out. I have no idea. Density and wealth are different. You can evolve to high density and have many low wealth workers. Oh, I see. So density is how many people you can cram into a thing. Okay, that's valid. That's valid. Uh, I guess I guess more specifically than I wanted a bit more of a slower growth. High density is going to mean more power and water use, even though that would mean more taxes. I guess that all makes sense. The good thing is a lot of the money I'm going to be receiving is going to be based on tourism. So the people that I'm going to be uh, collecting profits from doesn't even have to be here. Okay, we got enough power. That got us back online. We're still really bad on fire deployment. Oh, I could use the ring-a-ding-ding. -ding, the bell. Fire alarm. Whatever. I call it a ring-a-ding-ding. -ding. Uh, how's medic? Clinic full, turning away patients. Okay, this is how the zombie event happens. Let's do that. Let's do this. Uh, jail cells full, criminals released. That doesn't sound great. Now, let's talk where our real profit's gonna come from. Like I said, we're gonna be concentrating on tourism, which is great. Because I'm not pulling resources out of the ground, and I'm not mass producing anything. I'm not fabricating something from something else. We're generating very little actual pollution. Fire in the city. Yeah, you can you can deal with that. Um, I already did that. Burning down the house. How much is this? Fifteen. Isn't it just a couple of concrete slabs and a toilet? All right. All right, no, I want to take care of my prisoners, too. That's totally fine. Um, so, anyway, that means uh, clean energy, water, sanitation, and, like, a few other things we need to take care of is all we're really going to need to keep this base running. Base. <laughs> Played a lot of Yuri's Revenge Red Alert 2 recently with uh, Aislon, the fine gentleman I mentioned earlier. And it's all bases. You build a military base, you deploy forces from a base, you go attack an enemy base... Okay, this is perfect. The day after. It is now 4 in the morning. I'm going to accept this task right before everyone puts out their garbage. Now, where's my garbage? I think that's enough car or trucks. Garbage cars. What are they, Yugos? What kind is this? I have 60 students get to public schools in one day. I'm very confident you've trained... Or you're training. <laughs> you're teaching 600 kids a day. That's not a chief concern of mine. Wait, did you actually give me money? Oh, you're not going to give me any money. Okay, well, I'll just leave it. Uh, any destroyed buildings? Boop. Nothing? We good? Okay, what's the demand of stuff? Industrial demand is dark yellow. Which means what? Regional demand. Okay, I don't care about that. Regional demand I don't care about. I'm caring about local demand. Uh, what's the problem? Not enough garbage trucks. Okay, well, yeah, because the event just triggered. Yep, and I just got the award for have 60 students arrive. Because how many students are coming to school every day? 209, 212, 237, yep. And we collected 200 and some odd cans, which was literally 
five city blocks. Woof. Okay, well, that was enough of a kicker. Hey, okay. And we'll pay off the next one. So without a lot of micromanagement, we actually didn't need a city half this size, but I wanted to really start getting a good tax base in. Uh, speaking of tax... How much does that affect stuff? Well, pretty substantially, I'd say. Uh, yeah, I'll be able to pay off this other bond in no time. And as a sleepy little suburbia, this isn't too bad. Tip. What? Garbage creates pollution. Holy crap. Guys. Stop the clock. <laughs> Did you know that garbage creates pollution? <laughs> Holy crap. No idea. This whole time. No idea. What the hell? <laughs> I did not know that. Thanks, dude. <laughs> Just... Did you know that it hurts when you put the hot fire on your arm? It hurt real bad. It hurt like fire burny bad. Damn, look at my voice cracked right there. It hurts real bad. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for that. Your city advisor? Really? <laughs> Maybe you need to go to grade school, you weirdo. <laughs> hey, did, yeah, garbage creates pollution. We can't solve a garbage problem with a bulldozer. I beg to differ. Any house full of garbage or recycling is destroyed will dump tons of pollution to the ground. Be careful. Okay. <laughs> I get the rationale now. I get it. It's still really a dumb way to provide that information, but I get it. Another pipe. I know the wind is going in a very awful direction. Hey, the loan. Paying off the loans is the most important thing. Now we're sitting on 8.5k an hour. That sits really nicely with me. We'll need proper sanitation very soon. And a few other amenities to keep the game going. But that's not bad. It didn't really do anything, did it? <laughs> oh well. There we go. Alright. Get some of these places upgraded. Invest in a little bit of parks. So we'll check. Budget looks magnifique. I love it. 10% is probably the highest I'm willing to go on taxation. Ideally, I would like to lower my taxes if I'm making money off of gambling and such, if that's a really reliable income stream. Really like to treat it as if it's like Arizona, the way they like honestly handle it. Like, what is it? No sales tax? Because gambling? Or no income tax? Not income tax. You're the boss. Oh. Trips, it's easy to talk. You just open your mouth, your vocal cords vibrate, and out tumbles out hopefully whole words. It's it's great. It's easy. I would recommend it to anybody. Oh, we can do trains. Choo choo. I never learned to talk. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, easy fix. Text to speech. Uh huh. Text to speechify. Text to speechificate your language engineering skills. Have it set up so that way you type, and when you're talking to your Twitchy fans, you're all like, and now. A word from our sponsor, and a weird robot voice comes out. And now, beep boop, a word from our sponsor. Oh, right, right. That would be awesome. Use Morse code. <laughs> okay, it's going to sound like I'm physically attacking my desk. However, I'm speaking in a very arcane language. Morse code. <laughs> it's not that arcane. It's just the only word that came to mind. <laughs> beep boop. What the hell am I doing with this train station? Right, I was going to do something with this. Oh my god. Hey there guys, gals, fans, and pals, thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and Game With My Crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.